The problem with the economy today is that we have a bunch of idiots, like this geyser here, running the entire show. We need someone smart, we need someone strong, and we need someone bold to help run the nation or their business. We need someone who can stand up for themselves and fend them. But who do we get? Why, hello there! My name is Sherman Williams, and I here will be declaring myself as owner of this here store. I don't know what the hell this accent's for. When you're a business owner, you need to make sure everything is going the way it should be. You should be having your stock all set, you should be having your workers working, underpaid, apathetic workers, and you should always be organized. You need to know where everything is, you need to know what everything is doing from the start, you need to just go because you don't even need to worry about having to be prepared because you should always already be pre where the hell's my pop filter last time we were at this scene uh, it was more or less the same here the difference that I have is that um, I added another shelf which was only $500 so I can add a lot and um, I got I think what I got a I got a janitor because I was sick of um, having to like do this, so I can like be AFK. I don't have to sit here for half an hour to grind money and like arrest people. Well, I mean, I still have to arrest people, but that's my favorite. I like doing that. Yeah, I don't have any guards. So in this episode, hopefully, we can finish the roof, maybe make the store a bit bigger, and hopefully get a manager. Yes, it's been a while. Um, that this is how, like since I uploaded the last video. This is how I like it, and this is how it's probably going to go um also as you may notice i am standing up opposed from sitting down hopefully that can make me a bit more energetic and make better videos because that's that's what i care about no i honestly care about this store which is what we're going to try to do also maybe just upgrade a little bit of everything we need to get straight into doing this um and where should we start uh let's add Let's, let's start by shooting ourselves in the foot. Let's add another shelf. And that, that can do it. So this can be... Um, let's do toys. And then let's get... You, we always gotta have a little bit more. And hopefully actually so... Let's see. We have a two and a half star rating. We gotta bring that up. By the end of this episode it has to be three and a half stars. That's what, that's what the goal is going to be. I'm gonna be here for a long time. Let's get a ceiling. Oof. Um, so this is what we're gonna do. Let's see here. I want, where's my ceiling? I'm gonna do the normal ceiling. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, yeah, we're gonna do this. You'll see, you'll see what I'm gonna do. Or maybe we should have no ceiling, just have natural lighting. That's less money spent on electricity. I always think with my head. We can have the ceilings without having to worry about lighting above these here. I might add another storage unit here. Like, just, just for fun. I really don't know. And then... Like, to make... Like, it'll cost more to do this. But, like, have, like get rid of this and replace it with normal ceiling. We're not going to do that for now. What we are going to do... Is... What is this? Move. I I want to rotate you. Why why did I put you like that? There. And it's gonna take you a while. Oh, okay. You got that. Um Hmm. Let's see, what can we do now? Um I I think people are complaining about decoration. Decoration, yeah. Um that's probably our biggest downfall. Yeah, no, it is our biggest downfall. It's our only downfall, so we're gonna fix that. We're gonna do that real quick. Furnish. What what would be good? A fountain? Do we have space for a fountain? Why not? Now we have fountain. Look at that. Look at that. That that was pretty good. Now, what we gotta do. Let's make the store a bit bigger. Um Boulders. Oh, I don't know if we get rid of that wall yet. Uh, I don't think we will. So let's just like do this for now. And wait a minute. Oof. I forgot. 
that. I might need to buy this land here. I do. Alright, well. I guess we're we are tearing down all that wall. <laughs> I'm trying I'm trying to think smart and save a little bit of money as we go on, but um yeah, that's not gonna work, so we're just gonna do that. Um No what am I doing? I wanna move. Yeah, there we go. And then we need more toys already. Oh my god. Um Okay, that's set, and then... Oh look, Kevin's on! Hey, Kevin! <laughs> Assassin's Creed 316, that's his old username. Yeah, that tells you how much he plays Roblox, I'll tell you that. Oh no, I'm not, I don't have my hat. It's because I have to dress up like a businessman. Oh yeah, also I forgot! With, well, like, with this here, you can just like, j you can jump high, so you can just jump up on the ceiling here. Your friend Assassin's Creed 316 has joined the game. Thanks, system. Ruined my hair. Also, my headphones are broken. Okay, I kind of fixed it. But, like, the lip... Oh, this is not going to focus. The lip is broken. And then, like, the, the earmuff part. This is recent. This is getting destroyed. I'm trying to show... What? I can't. It's getting destroyed. I hate that. I had these headphones for a long time, too. Mm -hmm. Um, where are you? I am in your store. Oof. Buy my stuff. Or else you can't leave. What I have here is that this is my store. Okay. Cool. Which, I didn't know if you knew that. And then I'm also recording another video. This isn't Roblox, by the way. Remember? What is it? It's not. It's Store Simulator. It's not Roblox. I don't care what you say. That's so, cool. Kevin, you know what? I have idea. Help. And you what? have no choice. You're going to be a cash register because that's you, you. You can do that, right? You have the qualifications. Yeah. Ah. Um. <laughs> what is that dude doing? What is this dude doing? He just went over here, walked into. Get to her. work. Get this one right here. You get the front one. You need to make sure everything, everything, is going the way it should be. And then you just sit there and do nothing. Let's um. Let's add some more shelves. You know, what? I'm gonna go all out. Even though I'm losing money very fast, I want to buy an $800 freezer and shove it over here. R is to rotate, not Q. This isn't scrap mechanic. There we go. And then $8,000 doing fine. Supply. What what food goes in the refrigerator? Frozen food. Who knew? Um, books. We can add that, and then. Soda we can't. No, we, yeah, 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 And then, that can go into here. Or no, it can't. Oof. Well, I just wasted that. Um. So, alright. What do we do now? Um. Well, remember at the beginning of the video I said your workers have to be in line? You have to make sure... Everything's all set. We got. We got. You, you didn't. You didn't file a report saying that you were leaving. I don't even. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Um. Just freaking mouse. Let's see. I wanna. Let's move that while we can. Look, Kevin. I got a fountain, just like the one I have in real life. You don't have a fountain. I know. This is. I think I mentioned this before, like in the last video. But with the um, I said a goal was to get a manager. I'm gonna say this again, but basically what you do, not this furnish, you get an office desk, you place that down and then you hire a manager to run it. And then you select them to buy items for you. So literally if you have like, depending on how big your store is of course, if you have more, the, the um, like one of each worker, you just AFK, you go, you go play some Minecraft up on your Xbox so that you don't have because you already have a PC but it's cool because then you can go truly AFK and do nothing like a, a, an actual CEO of a company does which is really cool because I'm dressing completely CEO attire I, I don't have a tie but it's fine um, so I get like I don't if we are gonna do it in this episode no we are gonna do it in this episode hopefully 
but uh, I don't know if I want to put it right there or over here. But next, what I want to what I want to uh, work on is whoops. That's only five thousand dollars for like to get this, and I have one, two, three. Four. Okay, so I have the gravel lot. So hope so. In this episode, we need to get the small paved lot. Um, how much is the sign? Maybe if we can the sign, and then the manager. Hopefully, we can do that. It sounds pretty straightforward, and, and hopefully, we we can do it without too much trouble. Um, yeah, and also like one of, one of the problems I had with buying the uh, janitor is that like it 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 really depends on how big you are in the game. But, basically I'm a cheapskate, and the extra $20 a minute can go a long way. <laughs> but then, like, I got I got rid of a cash register for now, just temporarily, which is probably a dumb mistake, but, mm, um, and then maybe have to, maybe get rid of the janitor for a little bit, like, just to, like, increase money until we get a good start, and, like, until we get the manager, of course, and we should be good to go. Um, I keep on getting these points, I have no idea what the hell they mean. Because remember, this isn't Roblox. Have, okay, I'm going to... I don't know if I want to risk it. We have $10,000 now. So we can get both the sign and the driveway, theoretically. However, if you remember in the last episode, I said it's a good idea to like get $2,000 extra, or maybe more, since we have a bigger... Uh, uh, you know, a bigger thing. So like, when you restock, you don't go completely broke. And then lose all your money even quicker, which means that your upgrade will do effectively nothing until you get more money. Um, so, what we're going to do... Yeah, I can just do this. I'll buy 30 of each thing. Um, and hopefully that can do for a little bit. Don't buy books, that was a mistake. For frozen food, and then toys. So we should be good to go. We're a little bit more than halfway full on um, storage. So yeah, see, we're 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 eight and a half thousand now. So you always gotta be thinking off your feet, and you can just like, I'm what I'm. For the sake of the video, and I know it costs money to do this technically. I'm gonna get rid of the janitor. So in workers, I'm only losing forty dollars a minute, and I have. I have Kevin here, who's selling fidget spinners to people. We should be good, like, to gain money. And what I'm going to do, actually, is since I don't have any use for these two shells yet, and yes, I know, I'm, I'm losing... Whoops. I'm losing 20% of the value of that, but it'll just help us. It's worth it, and, and it'll work. Um... I accidentally got rid of the the toys, uh, the toy rack, the shelf. Oh, okay, that was a bad idea. And now I place this backwards. The ultimate trigger. Are you, are you gonna go incorrectly? What? I think this is retarded. Maybe a little. Toys. What? What is this? Communism! Move. Ro rotate. <laughs> was it because that person was there? Was it because those people are there? Really? There we go. And then... Yeah, there we go. Okay. I'm gonna risk it because why the hell not? As Kevin used to say, risk it for biscuit. We risk it for biscuit. Okay, so we did that. And maybe the sign. Can we can we Okay. Should we risk it? Why the hell not? There we go. And I'm gonna save. And there we go. We have about two thousand dollars, which is a little less than I would like. 
But we got this, and then we also have someone else. I think I already talked to this guy. Like, real store. And then... I have an idea. Hey Kevin, I put your name in the, uh... I put your name in the store name. It's pretty cool. Yay. <laughs> but yeah, so I like, I can just like sit here on the roof, just go AFK. Like, I can go get a cup of coffee. Kevin, you can run this. Um, just don't worry about anything. Just stay there. Um, and don't blow this store up. Okay, I'll be right back. I, I won't be long, I promise. All right, I'm back. I just I just wanted to go run a 17 mile bike ride. I, I don't know why I said I ran a bike ride. I I, 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 I bike ride for 17 miles, and then I uh, died of a heat stroke. I don't know if you knew this. It's we're all dying of a heat stroke in America over the past week, and um, I completely forgot about m robbers. Have we even had any robbers? I don't even know. Also, I learned- I, I like first person a lot better, however, you can't move your mouse, like, to go, like, if I go to options here, you can't move your mouse, because it moves you, so, like, you have to, like, it- I, I use the scroll wheel, by the way, so you just, like, I don't know, I'm still getting used to it. Oh, you can just do it while in the menu, cool, whatever. I like first person, it's okay, except the sensitivity between first person and third person is way bad. We need to restock. I'd probably be good. What the? <sighs> Why? That's all I have to. That's all I have to say. Why? Okay, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Um. Oh, look at that! It went back to normal. I don't get paid enough to do this. Oh, I didn't get toys. Oops. Like, what the? Uh. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, my God, I'm gonna <sighs> buy toys. There. And then I'll restock you. And let's. See. Do you go back to normal? No, you don't. So you know what? Whatever. It doesn't even matter. Oh, oh my God. what is <laughs> it? I'm more confused than whiny, okay? If that's. I'm, I don't think. In, I don't think we're gonna be able to, uh. get the desk. Like, for. You know what? Screw it. We got the desk. I, I just want to show. Oh, look, we got another human customer. Let's uh get a manager. I'm gonna go bankrupt. I'm gonna go. Ah, okay, that was a bad idea. So, manager, come here. I'm, I'm just gonna jump here. What all the Roblox play? I mean, store simulator players do. And like, here's the manager. You click on them. Wait, hold on. Manage. You click on them. Oh my God, we're at three and a half stars. Yeah. Okay. You don't click on them apparently. Yeah, right here. You can set to auto supply them, so I'm gonna set auto resupply ten. So even like even though I have this set to thirty, uh, I have this set to auto resupply ten per per minute. Every minute I get it buys ten. It uses my money, of course, so that's why I'm kind of, I don't know. So like I can get actually I'm gonna get twenty candy a minute. Like what you need to do is you need like. To make that the best, you need to, like, take statistics and, like, on average, how much people buy this per minute and then order that. Maybe a little bit more. But it, that's what you should do. That's not what I'm going to do now because I'm running out of time this episode. But, actually, no. This is the end of the episode here. However, surprisingly, we, I reached all the goals I wanted to. And we didn't get to listen to any more Africa. Actually, I don't know. I... I yeah...
I didn't get a copyright claim on that. Not, not saying that I have any ideas. But anyway, guys, that's the end of this episode here. Um, I hope it, I hope this was as enjoyable as the last one. I really liked the last one. And also, we got, got a special got a special guest here. So, um, thanks, Kevin, for randomly joining. Um, You're welcome. I'm not going to mark you down for being in the episode. And hope you see... I, what the... I'll see you guys in the next video.